I think the point that sometimes gets missed too in the GTHL is when you're talking about small area development, you know, the majority of your hockey players moving forward are going to be that house league crew, that A crew, the AE, and a lot of those kids don't like to practice. They want to have fun at practice. They don't want to come and do, you know, suicide drills and line drills. They want to come and have fun. And I think this is where a lot of kids tend to drop out after a while. Is if you're going to go to small ice and small area, you're doing reactive countering training, they might start to enjoy practice. and. If you're talking about growing the game moving forward, if that's ultimately the goal, then that's the way you do it. You've got to have the majority of your kids enjoying practice and getting better. No matter what, how good you are, Connor McDavid, he'll play men's league someday. If you can fill up your men's league and keep that kind of stuff going, you've got to enjoy it at a young age. Otherwise, if you don't have that skill set when you get older, you're not going to enjoy it and you might drop out.